and welcome to Airprise Mobile Asset Management for BMC Remini. Today we'll be showing the functionality of asset management on a BlackBerry device. There are two specific contexts for asset management. The first is the ability to download hundreds to thousands of records for a physical audit that may take the end user technician in and out of signal range on their BlackBerry. Here you can see an example of such a download. During this time, the technician needs only to search and update the records on their device, and when they complete the task at the end of the day, any records not processed can be processed when the technician is back in signal range. If on the other hand, the technician is fairly certain of good coverage during the day, they have the ability to limit the amount of records that get pushed down to the device and focus more on 100% real-time updates. This demonstration will focus on the real-time update model. We will start with the example of a physical audit in a customer environment. We will start with a search on the BlackBerry device, where we enter the serial number of an asset we have discovered. As we request a server search, the device sends the appropriate information back to the Remedy server for retrieval. With the BlackBerry device, the technician has the ability to connect a Bluetooth scanner, such as the Rove scanner from Microvision. With this device, serial numbers, asset tags, and service tags can be scanned directly into the BlackBerry, eliminating error and excessive keyboard typing. As this record returns to the device, we will open the record to see that any of the information that the technician needs can be delivered to the BlackBerry. This information can be the bulk of the fields from Remedy, or they can be specific fields necessary to appropriately audit the physical asset in an office or warehouse environment. In our example, we will actually update some of the information we see. We will assume that the information here is incorrect because of a clerical error during an earlier paper-based audit and now that the technician has full access to Remedy and they are sending over the piece of equipment in question, they can enter the exact information to clean this asset record in Remedy. This ensures that any liability from audits for Sarbanes-Oxley or other regulatory processing can be avoided. We have updated the asset description and have added a tag number which was not in this record originally. As we save this record back to Remedy, we receive a positive confirmation of the update. When we go to Remedy and refresh our asset table, we can then drill down into the record in question. At this time, you can see that the appropriate updates have been sent to Remedy for this asset. This series of steps works well for physical inventories, but it's also crucial for day-to-day -day functions, such as moving an employee and their assets from one location to another. In the case of a move, we can employ an enterprise function called bulk update that would allow for multiple records to be changed in one pass simplifying the asset move process. Our next example will be the case where a search brings back a no records found condition. In this case, we would need to create the asset record in the field. We will activate the Airprise create functionality. At this time, we will add the information for the appropriate fields, such as serial number, asset tag number, CI description, etc. With Airprise, the device identifies the required fields with a star similar to how you see these fields in a Remedy desktop tool. That way, a technician doesn't have to guess on the absolute requirements to create an asset record. Even if a technician ignores the required fields on an attempt to save the record back to Remedy, the BlackBerry will display the same error messages that a Remedy desktop would issue in notifying the technician that the record is not yet complete. As we complete the creation of the record on the BlackBerry, we will save this record back to Remedy server. Again, you will notice that we receive positive confirmation of the completion. Since the experience of working from a mobile device is decidedly different from working at a desktop, we want to eliminate any question from the end user technician regarding the success of an activity. When we return to Remedy and refresh our asset record, you will see that the record has been created with all the appropriate fields. By providing the capability to search an asset record, update the asset record if found, or create the asset record if not found, we manage 90% of the field asset management requirements. If you have questions about further asset management capabilities within Enterprise, please reach out to your Remedy account representative. This ends the demonstration of Enterprise Mobile Asset Management for Remedy.